In America, this is a special week. It's the week that we celebrate the 4th of July, celebrating independence and celebrating freedom. But no matter where you live in our world, you can celebrate also. You can celebrate the freedom of spirit through God. And your life will be transformed through the freedom of spirit. It says in 2 Corinthians 3, verses 17 and 18, Now the Lord is the Spirit, and where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. All of us are being transformed into the same image from one degree of glory to another. Well, I pray this week that you experience a personal freedom. I pray that you are completely free with the freedom of spirit. Now, what does that mean in a very practical way? Well, it means that through God, you are free from worry. Through God, you are free from doubt. Through God, you are free from any sense of insecurity. You have a new sense about who you are because of what you're connected to. As you think about freedom of spirit, you release each thought and you let it be a wave of peace that moves throughout your entire body. How relaxed you feel, how free you feel, how at peace you are with yourself and with the whole world. You store this feeling of freedom in your memory so that you can claim it at any time. You can claim freedom because you're free with the freedom of spirit and God's loving spirit is always with you. It is the Spirit of God within you that transforms your life into one of everlasting peace. You are living a life of freedom. Now I pray with you that your life this minute through the touch of God is transformed with the freedom of Spirit. Your mind is touched by God and it is transformed with the freedom of spirit. You have a power in you that is God-given, coming through you from center to circumference, freeing you from worry. You are now freed from doubt. You are now free from any sense of insecurity. Through the power of God's touch, you are permanently set free. Through the power of God's touch, you are able to claim your freedom and become a free child of God. There is freedom in God. You and I claim it now in the name and through the power of Jesus Christ. Amen.